Hi, my name is Dr. Andrea Teke. I am one of the pediatricians here at North Shore Health Center, and welcome to another episode of Ask the Expert. On this episode of Ask the Expert, I'll be focusing on summer tips uh, for your family. Um, now that the weather is nice and warm, hopefully your family is going outside and doing different activities like swimming, biking, and hiking. But there's a couple of things that we can do to make sure we protect ourselves when we're out in the sun. One of the things we can do is protecting our skin. And one of the ways that we can do it is wearing lightweight clothing that's cotton, long sleeves to cover like our arms and legs, wide brimmed hats, sunglasses. Areas that are not covered by this protective sun gear, um, we recommend applying sunscreen. For kids um, between the ages of infancy up until six months, for areas that are still exposed to the sun, you can apply um, a small amount of sunscreen at SPF 15. Um, for children six months and older, um, you can definitely also do the lightweight clothing, hats, sunglasses, uh, we recommend the swim shirts, but using a sunscreen at SPF 15 or higher. Now when purchasing a sunscreen, we recommend that you purchase the Bod Spectrum sunscreen that protects you against UVA and UVB light, and try to avoid sunscreen that contains the ingredient oxybenzone. When applying sunscreen, we recommend that you do it at least 30 minutes prior to sun exposure. And if any of your activities cause excessive sweating or you're in the water, we recommend that you're applying it at least every two hours. Other things that we can do to help protect our skin when we're outside is against insect bites. You may be outside in the woods, hiking, or if you're um, outside late in the evening by stagnant water like bird baths or pools, you may be exposed to insects like mosquitoes and tick bites. Ways that we can um, reduce the risk of getting bites from these different types of insects, again, wearing that lightweight clothing we talked about, also avoiding um, perfumes or scented soaps, and then avoiding very bright colored clothing. In addition to that, we recommend using insect repellent that has DEETS in it um, with 10% to 30%. The AAP and the CDC recommends children two months and older to actually use insect repellent with DEETS in it. Other things that you can use to protect your skin that are natural are things like peppermint, um, citrulline, as well as geranium. Swimming is a great exercise that a lot of us do um, during the summertime, whether it be at the pool or in open waters, but it does come with frisk. So here are a couple of tips to make sure uh, when you go swimming that everybody is kept safe. With private pools especially, you wanna make sure there is a fence that's covering the perimeter or all sides of the pool, at least four feet high. Also make sure there is an adult available um, for supervision of all kids, especially one that is CPR certified and who knows how to swim. We also want to make sure um, kids are wearing life jackets whether at the pool, on a boat, or in open water, and make sure the life jackets are for their size. When boating, make sure they're wearing life jackets on the boat as well as on the dock or any areas that the children are exposed to water. For open water swim, make sure you're never swimming alone and try to avoid areas um, that are limited for swimming and diving. Next month, we'll be celebrating um, the holiday July 4th. And a lot of times uh, to celebrate this holiday, we like to look at fireworks and use fireworks. But fireworks have increased risk of injury, um, such as blindness, partial hearing loss, burns, and even death. Some of the fireworks that we consider safe, like sparklers, can actually get up to temperatures of 1,000 degrees Fahrenheit or above that can put us all at risk for burns as well. In 2020, um, 900 um, ED visits were for the treatment of sparklers that were used by children. Um, so instead of having your own fireworks, we recommend that you go to some community event and let their professionals take care of the fireworks. I hope you have a safe and happy summer. And for more tips, you can go to the American Academy of Pediatrics website at healthychildren.org. And for more information about North Shore Health Centers, please visit northshorehealth.org.